Hello friends, welcome to this current affairs session here and uh, we will discuss some questions along with the uh, static fact based on the correct options in individual questions. These are the questions is very important for your upcoming mains examination. So please watch this session carefully and try to remember maximum input from this session. So here we are moving to question number one here. Rajasthan CM approves the proposal of what amount for its minority affairs? And the answer is 98.55 crore rupees. Option B is the correct answer. For the inclusive development of the minority community in Rajasthan, Chief Minister Ashok Gehlad has approved a revised proposal to spend 98.55 crore rupees in various schemes from a fund of 100 crore set up for the upliftment of the minorities. As per the proposal, these are the some different facts. 50 lakh will be spent on development of traditional skill for the people of minority. 1.25 crore will be allocated for the assistance to minority craftsmen and 21.80 crore will be spent on construction of an English medium residential school in Jaipur, which is the capital, right? And the governor of Rajasthan, that is Kalraj Mitra, right? Who won the FIFA Men's Player of the Year Award 2021? And the answer is option C, Robert Lewandowski. Robert Lewandowski has won the FIFA Men's Player of the Year Award 2021. Baron Munich, Robert Lewandowski has been named as the best FIFA Men's Player of the Year Award for a second time in a row. Spain midfielder Alexia Putles, who had made the best FIFA Women's Player shortlist for the first time, won the prestigious award from Women's category. It is. And Lewandowski defeated Lionel Messi. And Mohammed Saleh to clinch the award for the second time in a row. Which state started rupees 10 clinic to serve the economically weaker section? And that is Hyderabad. In an attempt to provide affordable medical care to the economically weaker section, Dr. Roslyn and organizer from the Hyderabad decided to treat the patient for rupees 10 at a clinic at the Ambedkar Bhavan in Neredmet Metchal Malkajgiri district in Telangana. Okay, quite a tough name, yeah. Metchal Malkajgiri district in Telangana. That is it, and the answer here is Hyderabad. Telangana's capital is Hyderabad. K. Chandrasekhar Rao is the CM, Tamil Nadu's Sundararajan is the governor. Which film has won the Toronto Film Critics Association as the best picture in 2021? And that is Drive My Car. Drive My Car won the Toronto Film Critics Association as the best picture in 2021. And these are two, The Power of the Dog and Licorice Pizza. These two are the runner surprise. Uh, these two films got the runner surprise in category um, as the best picture award 2021. But the best picture award 2021 received by Drive My Car and the two runners up set up that is The Power of the Dog and the Licorice Pizza. Toronto Film Critics Association named Drive My Car its best picture 2021. Rasuk Hamaguchi Samba drama about the love and loss continued its buzzy ascent as an award season contender. And some of the extra information here best picture award goes to Drive My Car, best director received by Jen Campion, Power of Dog Netflix, and the best actress Olivia Colman from the film that is The Lost Daughter, right? Some more fact here, Best Supporting Actress received by J.C. Barclay, The Lost Daughter. The best Supporting Actor that is Bradley Cooper, Licorice Pizza. That is from Universal Pictures of Canada, that is Licorice Pizza. And the Best Screenplay Adapted or Original that is by received by Drive My Car, which is also the answer here in this question. That is the Best uh, Picture Award that is in 2021. And the best actor that is Daniel Washington from the tragedy of Macbeth. Best first literature that is the lost daughter again. Best animated feature that is flea from television picture. Best inter international feature film that is again drive my car from films we like. And uh, Alan King documentary film award that is received by summer of soul from searchlight. Right. Who has become the next army vice chief of India and that is Lieutenant General. Monoch Pandey, here is the pick, right? 
Sources in the government say that a proposal to appoint Lieutenant General Manoj Pandey as the next Vice Chief of Army Staff has been approved. Manoj Pandey has tenanted important staff assignment and was posted as the Chief Engineer at the United Nations Mission in Ethiopia and Eritrea. He was the Director General at the Army Headquarters dealing with subjects of dis discipline, ceremonial and welfare. So the answer is Lieutenant General Manoj Pandey has become the next Army Vice Chief of India. Who has been appointed as the Russian Ambassador to India? And the answer is option A, Denis Alipov. Denis Alipov has been named as Russia's new envoy to India. He is a career diplomat and dedicated India specialist with decades of experience. During the tenure of Russian Ambassador Alexander Kadakin, he served as a Deputy Chief of Mission in the Russian Embassy in Delhi. During the tenure of Alexander Kadakin, when uh, Denis Alipov served as the Deputy Chief of Mission of Russian Embassy in Delhi. Ambassador Denis has also worked as the Deputy Director of the Russian Foreign Ministry, Second Asian Department. And Russia, Moscow is the capital currency's ruble. Mikhail Mishustin is the Prime Minister. Vladimir Putin is the President. Which company shared tribute to Ali Ojun's Pushpa, the rise? And the answer is option C, Amul. Dairy brand Amul paid the cutest tribute to the Alu Ojuns Puspa, the rise. The artwork featured the cartoons resembling the Alu Ojuns and Rashmika Mandan Mandana's characters from the film. The actor was overwhelmed seeing the creative artwork and took the comments to thank the team, right? And that is directed by Sukumar. Uh, the important stuff here is that Amul is a company gives a shared tribute to Alu Ojuns Puspa, the rise. That is the thing here, right? Okay. Reliance Retail picks up what person in adverb technology? Adverb technology. This is the part here. And that is 54%. Mukesh Ambani led Reliance Retail has acquired a 54% stake in domestic robotics company. Adverb, that is the company's name. $132 million, approximately 983 crore. A senior official robotic firm said this. Adverb Technologies co founder and CEO Mr. Sangit Kumar told PTI that uh, the company will continue to operate independently and will use the funds received from the Reliance to expand the business overseas as well as set up one of the biggest robotic manufacturing facilities in Noida. So 54% the retail picks up by Reliance in Adverb Technologies. That is it, right? So I hope you understood all the news bullets here and that is all for now. Good time.